Guys, welcome back to World Illuminator 11 and welcome if it is your first time checking out the channel. So we are bringing in five decks today. Nature's blessings, breaking out of the matrix, nature's whispers, power in nature, twin flame oracle and the guardian angel inspiration deck. And these are going to be messages for everyone. And that's the guidance I'm really getting because we are in a powerful week this week. There is a lot that is going on. Um, we are... And spring equinox here in the northern hemisphere. And then we also have the start of Aries season. And Aries is the first sign of the zodiac. So it is the start of the new astrological year as well. And, you know, and then with the spring equinox energy, there's this new energy of new beginnings. And Aries is about moving forward. You know, it's a fire sign. It's about things moving forward. So they, you will be feeling that momentum building up as well for things to move forward when it comes to your dreams, the things you're working on. You know, it's like things are charging forward. It's like new beginnings coming in as well when it comes to all areas of your life. So, you know, it's a powerful time that we're in. And then to add on to that, we've also have eclipse season that is uh, that we are in as well or that is starting. So we have, this is a time of transformation. This is a time of change. You know, you're transforming into higher consciousness within yourself, moving forward on your own spiritual path. But there can also be changes happening in your life, endings happening, things falling away. You know, it could be in your 3D world, but you could be in that energy of working through, releasing certain things. We're moving as well towards um, the full moon that is coming up in a few days time. So, you know, there's a lot of this energy that is sort of working through us at this time, you know, so you may be feeling it within yourself. I know I'm certainly feeling it. You know, I'm feeling the energies um, quite significantly. And then to add on to that, I've had like, uh, you know, the past weekend where there's been a lot of stuff going on energetically, a lot of releasing, healing. So there's a lot happening. And my dream state is a whole different level at this time. There's a lot that is going on. So that's why I'm really needing to look after myself, take care of myself. And this is a message for everyone to really be there for yourself. You may be, you know, going through certain emotions, certain things happening in your life, you know, things being released and all sorts going on. You know, we we all experience these things on a different way you know, and on a different level, depending on where we are on our own journey. So, you know, it's about being there for yourself, giving yourself the love, the rest, the, you know, being there for yourself with love and compassion as well. And, you know, and really looking after yourself and self-care. But it's just about remembering there's a lot that is happening and it's all happening to help us to move forward on our path. You know, sometimes the, it's, it's, it is about riding the wave and sometimes you can go down with that wave and then it brings you up again and down and up again. So it's about riding the wave and always remember that whatever it is that you're going through, you know, it is there to help you to move forward on your path. You know, sometimes it can be challenging. Sometimes it can be difficult. But know that whatever it is you're experiencing, it's part of what your soul chose for you to go through so that you can be able to work through those things, release those things, evolve and move forward on your own path. So really be in the place of compassion and love for yourself. You know, see whatever you can find and see to be grateful for in whatever that situation is that you are going through. You know, even in the most difficult situations, there are some blessings that you can see, other things that are happening in your life, even the small things, you know, being that energy of gratitude, because the more you focus on that, you know, being grateful for the blessings that you have or the lessons that you're learning from that situation, you know, that energy of gratitude takes you out of the energy or feeling like a victim or, you know, or getting lost in the challenging things that are happening, it sort of makes your focus be on things that are positive, things that you're grateful for. And that really shifts the way you go, you ride that wave of whatever may be going on in your life. So really look after yourself and, um, and someone is buzzing. So I'm, I'll just pause this and then I'll carry on.
Right. Okay. So that was actually not even someone coming for me. So they were just trying to get into the building. So anyway, so let's move into the reading and see what messages are coming through for everyone. So thank you, angels. With these energies that we're in at this time, what does everyone need to know right now? So we've got this card and this one. And then thank you, angels. Breaking out of the matrix. What does everyone need to know? At this time, what messages are coming through for everyone? So we've got this one, this one, and that one, okay? And then, thank you, angels. What messages are coming through as well for everyone today? What does everyone need to know at this time? What does everyone need to know? So we've got that one, and those two, okay? And then, thank you, angels. What messages are coming through for everyone? What does everyone need to know at this time? What messages are coming through? So we've got two cards there. And this one here. And one more here. And then to finish off from the angels, what messages are coming through? Inspiration. Thank you, angels. So we've got that one from your guardian angel. That one. This one. This one here and that one. Right, so let's see what messages are coming through today. Right, so turning these round. So the first message that we have is relax and take a deep breath. There is, there is more time than you think. Time is psychological. When we panic, time speeds up. Achieve all you need to do by relaxing your mind. Slow and steady wins the race. So this is a powerful message to come through. So, you know, you may be having a lot going on and you may be feeling all sorts of emotions, things happening as well in your life at this time. You're being asked to relax and take a deep breath. There is more time than you think when it comes to your twin flame journey, when it comes to whatever it is that you are trying to work through or trying to do, you have more time than you think. Maybe you just need the time to relax. You know, maybe you're going through a lot of things emotionally or in your life, things changing, you know, with this um, eclipse energy, the season that we're in, you know, there may be a lot going on and you're trying to do so much, you know, or thinking so much and you're being asked to just relax. You know, take time for yourself. Take time to look after you. Take time to rest if you need to. You know, there will be time for you to do those things. There's more time than you think. So I feel you're being asked to just relax, you know, and you can achieve all you need to do by relaxing your mind. So it's about you looking after yourself and slow and steady wins the race. You don't need to be rushing to do anything. Take your time. And if it means that you just need to just relax and look after you, then do that. Slow and steady wins the race. So that's a message that's coming through for everyone today. And then we also have here, it's been a long, hard climb. But finally, you are being given the opportunity to pause and reflect on how far you've come. As you look around, you'll be amazed to see just how much you've accomplished. So, you know, you've been going through a lot and it's been a long, hard climb when it comes to your life, you know, and I feel what you're being shown here is that there is a change that is coming in. You know, something new is coming in on the horizon and this new, uh, this spring equinox or this equinox energy that we're in, this is all about new beginnings. We are in the, at the start of a new astrological year. There are new beginnings that are coming in. So you're being asked to just pause and reflect, to not try and rush anything, you know, and just take your time. Slow and steady wins the race. Know that those new beginnings are coming in. Everything is opening up. As I was saying at the beginning, you know, we're in airy season. This is about things moving forward, things starting to happen. So trust that everything is coming in for you at the perfect time. You know, see how far you've come, all the work that you've been putting in on yourself, you know, pause and reflect on that. And, you know, and really see that you've come a long way and, you know, and you'll be amazed to see just how much you've accomplished when it comes to your own path, when it comes to the things that you're working on. And I feel you're being shown that there are new beginnings that are coming in. So take your time, pause, don't rush anything. Trust that everything is coming in for you as well when it comes to new beginnings. 
And then the other cards that have come out as well. So first card that we have is let go of judgment and accept that we are all different and unique. We all have our own paths to follow and life lessons to learn. So this is just a reminder to let go of judgment, you know, of judgment of others, judgment of your divine masculine, you know, where others may be on their own journey, what they're doing with their life, what your divine masculine is doing, where they are, you know, it's about accepting that we're all different and unique and we all have our own paths and to follow and life lessons to learn. So, you know, whatever path your divine masculine is on, that is their own path. You know, there they are lessons that they need to learn where they are. You know, they are things that they need to go through. They are, you know, they, they need to grow and evolve from the, from that situation that they're in. So you're being asked to let go of judgment, to be in that energy of acceptance. So whatever, it may be something that you're working through as well on your own path right now to release judgment, you know, so let go of that. We've got the full moon coming in as well. That's a time of releasing and letting go. Use that energy to release any of the judgment energy that may be within you so that you get more into that place of acceptance. So that's the message that's coming through there. And then we also have here the repetitive thoughts, ideas, and promptings you have been experiencing are indicating which path to follow. Listen to your inner guidance. You are supported as you break free from old, outdated restraints. Follow the urges of your soul. So you're being guided on your path. It's a reminder that you're being guided every step of the way. And it's about you listening to your inner guidance. There are some repetitive thoughts that you may get. You know, some ideas that keep coming up. Promptings, promptings coming in from your soul, from your angels to help you to move forward on your path. So you are being supported as you work through breaking free from old, outdated restraints. These are things that you are releasing from your life so that you can be able to move forward. As I said, you know, these energies that we're in are there to help you to move into higher consciousness, to release what is holding you back, to step more into your true power, to move forward as well on your path. So listen to the guidance that's coming in, you know, and release the old outdated restraints, you know, limiting beliefs, judgment, all those things that you need to let go of because it's, uh, they are there holding you back from stepping into your true power, into who you're truly here to be and follow the urges of your soul when it comes to those ideas, those promptings, those new experiences that you're being guided to go for. You know, your being guided is there for a reason. So that's a message that's also coming through for you. And then we also have here encourages you to look to encourages you to to look encourages you to look to higher learning, studying and researching topics that genuinely interest and resonate with your soul. So this is also a message for you to do things that are there to help you move forward, you know, maybe to learn something, maybe you're being guided to, you know, one of the promptings or uh, repetitive thoughts that keep coming up for you are to start a new course, to learn something new, you know, to research something, to work on something for yourself. Those, that means those messages are coming through so that you can be able to move forward. There are reasons why you're getting those messages coming in. It's about listening to that. It's like your soul is guiding you to do that so that you can be able to move forward. It can be something that is there to help you to work on your mission or to help others, whatever it is. So the message is for you to go for those messages that are coming through. Listen, listen to your inner guidance. And then the cards that have also come out, we also have here, trust your own understanding. So really powerful. So I really feel you're being reminded here to really listen to what's going on from within. The messages that are coming in for you, trust your own understanding, the guidance that you are receiving. When it comes to whatever area of your life, you are being guided. So trust your own understanding. You know what is right for you. Your soul is guiding you. Your angels are guiding you. So trust your own understanding and move forward with that. Rather than being there to always listen to what someone else is telling you to do. You know, you have your own 
understanding from within. Trust your own understanding. Move forward when it comes to that. And then we also have adventure that has come out. And I feel here you're being shown that, you know, we sort of like spring equinox, you know, this is about moving into springtime. This is the time where everything is starting to open up. And, you know, this is the time of adventure. And, you know, and I feel you're being shown that this time that we're in is opening us all up to new adventures, new adventures when it comes to, you know, going out in nature, spending time out, the new beginnings that are coming in, bringing in adventure into your life. There are new beginnings that are coming in to bring in change, you know, to bring in uh, maybe even moving house or, you know, starting a new job. There are opportunities that are coming in to bring in more of that adventure into your life you know, to do things in a new way. So I feel you're being shown here that there is a lot of adventure that is coming in. So it's about trusting that in where you're being guided, you know, trust your own understanding to, and your inner guidance to lead you to that adventure. Those ideas that come into your mind, they are there to help you to move forward to, you know, the adventures that are coming in for your life as well. And then we also have to finish off here, we have potential gateway, which is a beautiful card. And I feel that here, what you're being shown is that, you know, this is that potential gateway to that life that you are dreaming of, you know, to that life that is of new beginnings, of the love coming in for you, everything opening up for you, opportunities for new adventure. You know, there is things are opening up. That's what I really feel that these two cards are showing you that things are opening up. We're moving into this time of new beginnings or we are now in this time of new beginnings that is opening up to, you know, endless possibilities when it comes to your life, you know, potential for all the dreams that you have to come true. So you are being shown that all these things are coming in. It's about trusting in that. And then we also have here, so how powerful, a new start is on the horizon, new beginnings. So you're really being shown that this time that we're in is opening us all up to new beginnings. A new start is on the horizon. So new opportunities are coming in, endless possibilities coming in for you, you know, adventure coming in. It's a powerful time. Yes, there's a lot that we're working through, a lot that we're releasing, a lot that we are healing with in ourselves, but it is also a time that is opening us up to new beginnings to that are on the horizon, which was the same energy that was coming through as well here that you've been climbing this mountain and, you know, now you are starting to just get to this place of pausing and reflecting on how far you've come, but also this is opening you up to new beginnings. So all your hard work is paying off and new beginnings are coming in. They are on the horizon. And then we also have here, take your focus away from the outside world, go within. So you're being reminded as well to spend time going within. Maybe you're working through certain things right now within yourself. You know, maybe you have um, certain things that are happening in your life that you just need to go within, find the answers you know, listen to the messages coming through from within. That's what you are being asked to do here. So whatever you may be going through, the message is to go within. You have all the answers within. Then we also have here relax, rest and relax. There is no need to worry. Relax and look after yourself. So again, that message that was coming through at the beginning about being there for yourself. You know, there's no need to rush anything. Also came through with that first card. You know, slow and steady wins the race. It gets you to where you're wanting to be. So release any fears, release any worries, know that you are supported on your path. And whatever you're going through, as I was saying before, focus on, you know, the on gratitude, see the blessings in that situation rather than focusing on the things that are challenging and being in that energy of worry when in relation to that, the message is there is no need to worry. Everything that you are going through is there to help you to move forward on your own path. So the message is there is no need to worry and relax and look after yourself. So make time to look after you. 
And to finish off, we also have angel protection. You are safe and protected. So whatever you're going through, that's what the angels are reminding you here. You are safe and protected. You know, the universe has got your back and, you know, the angels are there with you protecting you and you are safe. So it's something that you can actually say if you're going through challenging times with changes happening during this time or with the eclipse um, season, you know, just say to yourself, I am safe. I am protected. And it's a way for you to remember, you know, whilst you're going through a difficult time that you have that love and support and, you know, protection from above. So you are safe and protected. And then the cards that have also come out from the angels to finish off, there is no room for fear or only love. So through whatever it is that you may be going through, you're being asked to release the worry. There is no room for fear. Release any fear. Know that you are safe and protected and focus on love. That's the big message that's coming through. And then we also have here, it's all about flow, not about chasing, pushing, forcing, or trying so hard. So you're being reminded to be in that energy of flow. You know, you don't need to be pushing or chasing or trying so hard or trying to make things happen. Be in the energy of flow. New beginnings are on the horizon. Things are happening the way that they're meant to, to bring in those new beginnings, those gateways, potential gateways for new possibilities and adventure coming in for you. So there's no need to try and force anything. Just be in that energy of flow. And then we also have, you are here to love and be loved. Do you feel all this love around you? So the angels are coming through. Your guardian angel is saying to you, you know, do you feel the love that is there from heaven, from your angels, from your spirit guides, your ancestors, you know, the love that is there from your twin, you know, your divine counterpart that is there all around you. Do you feel that love? So you are here to love and be loved. So this is about you focusing on only love as well, coming from that energy of love in everything that you do. And then we also have again, so this one really goes with this one, with this card here. Here. The power is within you. Go within, connect with it. So the power is within. So you're being reminded, whatever you may be going through, even if it's a difficult and challenging time in your life, you know, make time to go within. Take your focus away from the outside world. Go within. That is where you find your true power. And whatever you may be going through is there to help you to step more into that true power of yours. So go within. You know, you will find the answers and it will help you as well to find more of that peace. You know, even if you're going through difficult things, the, when you um, get out of your mind and that worrying too much and you go within, you make time to just be and just sit with whatever it is that you're going through. It will help you to find more of that peace. So I really feel that, you know, it's a reminder that if you're going through something during this time that we're in to come back within, you know, that is what is going to help you on your path. And then to finish off, a calm mind brings you inner peace. So again, that meditation will help you to find more of that calm as well in your mind. You know, release the worry, find that inner peace, go out in nature, spend time in nature, spend time doing things that help you to feel calm within yourself, such as meditation, you know, and, and just calm your mind. Whatever it is that's happening in your life, be in that energy of finding that inner peace. When you have inner peace, you know, you are in a powerful place within yourself. So that's the message coming through. A calm mind, a calm mind brings you inner peace. So find that peace in your life. And, you know, it's a powerful time. Things are moving forward. Yes, it may be up and down, riding the wave of challenges and things going on, or maybe releasing and working through things within yourself. But everything is opening you up to those new beginnings that are coming in. You know, endless possibilities of adventure, of the life that you're dreaming of. Everything is coming in. So know you are safe and protected. Find your true power within. Ride that wave and know that great things are coming in for you. So those are the messages coming through. I hope you have a great day. Sending you all so much love.